Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how you can copy and paste values into an Excel worksheet. Now, we all know the regular copy and paste with Control v but what if you try to copy and paste for formulas from one cell to another or one worksheet to another? Would you get the same results or something completely different? Let's test it out right now then. As you can see in cell A1, I'm going to type in the formula equal to rand between to generate random numbers between 1 and one and 1000. Now, this is a random number so it gets constantly updated every time you enter something new, like let's say this value, it went from 603 to 638, or this, now it went to 909, or if you try to delete something or change the worksheet in any way, like this, it went to 353. Now, if you try to do it like a control copy and paste, regular stuff, control C, and then control V and cell C1 here, you'll notice that the numbers completely changed from um, the original of 443, I believe, to 671, and the new paste value is 201 now. This isn't exactly what we want, um, because when you do like a regular copy and paste, it's just copying the formula of what's shown in the formula bar to this cell here and if you want to change that right if you want to like stick with the same number of six seven like six seventy one right now so if you do control C you can do control alt B and you can get this menu called paste special you click on values and it press OK and now you get the original number of six seventy one even though this number changed again to two thirty two Now, let's say if you try to like, let's say you don't want this number to change, right? You want it to stay as 232. Then you can do Control C here on cell A1. And then Control Alt V, same thing. And then go to Values. And it converted the formula that you saw ran between 1 to 1000 to 232. Now, what we've been using is the keyboard shortcut Control Alt V. But there are plenty of other ways you can do it as well. So let's try it out right now. So let's try it out the other ways right now. So we will use the same formula for rand between equal to rand between 1 to 1000. Oops. Uh, 1000 here. And basically we want to copy this 410 that's shown here in the cell in A1 to cell C1 here. And you don't want a number to change either. So we've been using it with um, Control Alt V. Well, Control C, then Control Alt V. Now we can use another keyboard shortcut. So let's do Control C here. Move the, this to like cell C1. And now we can do Alt, H, V, and S. Now you get this pay special menu pop up as well, same as before. And you go to values here. And you see the 410 here appear here right now without the formula. So equals to rand between on cell A1, and this one just shows the actual number itself. If you want to stay, in, if you want this to like stay the same number, then you can do the same thing: Alt H, V. Oh, oh sorry. Um, I meant Control C, then Alt H, uh, V, and S for paste special, and then you go to values, and this sticks with. And the states as 286. Now let's say you didn't want to use any keyboard shortcuts but you wanted to use the mouse only. You can do the same thing delete this and delete this equals to rand between 1 and 1000 and you get the number 774 here. Now you basically can do like a right click for copy and in this and in this cell let's paste the value here now keep a note of it it's a 774 here right so if you go to um the cell c1 here go to paste menu and then click on values paste values here and you'll notice that the number changed from 774 to 84. um now it still did it still worked perfectly fine the paste value um, it looks like for when you're using the mouse, the numbers just change randomly anyways, when you instead of using the keyboard shortcuts. 
So if you're using like random numbers to paste values, then I would recommend definitely recommend using the keyboard shortcuts and it can still be faster once you get the hang of it. But the mouse using the mouse still did its job um, of pasting the values as you don't see the formula ran between here anymore. So we've gone over how you can do paste values is using keyboard shortcuts like Control Alt V and Alt H uh, V S and also using the mouse for these um, to like paste values um, using simple examples. Let's try to use an example that you might see in like a real life situation using the same ran um, random number function but this time you want to input an if statement as well for the next column. So let's go to column, um, we'll sell A1 here equal to rand between 1 to 1000 and let's fill it up to the next 20 rows. Now we have um, 20 numbers, um, well 20, ran 20 random numbers between 1 and 1000 that changes every time you alter the worksheet. And in column B, we're going to be using the if statement equal to if, where if the number is greater than 500, then we would return big. But if it's less than, well if it's greater than or, or equal to 500, then we would return big. But less than 500 would be small. So if A1 is greater than or equal to 500 then big else um, for less than 500 it would, it would be small and then we can drag the formula down now now this um, now each value in column B is connected to each value in column A. So every time the numbers in column A changes, the values in column B changes as well. Now let's say you didn't want these values to change either. So, but you want um, these two to be appear appear in another column. You can do Control Shift down, and then Control C, and in column E or any column. Going to control alt b and you'll notice that the exact same values appear as before before um it changed from the random num no, random numbers now if you want to include let's see, if you want to include both the numbers and the um big and small statements you can do control shift right then down control c and control alt b to get these um, the previous values and if you want to just like paste over the same um, formulas here then you control C control alt B and you get rid of you get rid of the formulas now you can also do the same thing um, to different worksheets and files Excel files as well so we have the formulas back with control Z and if you do control um, shift right then down control C and you move to the next worksheet here um, now note the the number of first two is 0 0.9 and 324 small small and if you do control alt B you get the same values as before um, although the numbers still change from the original worksheet but you can also like paste values into like different worksheets as well Now that does it for um, our demonstration for copy paste values. I hope this video was helpful and if it was then please like and subscribe.